What's going on everybody? I hope you're all having a beautiful day. Welcome back to the YouTube channel. It's been a minute since we did a video on here. What I want to address really quickly before you today is how to mow a hill. This is a steep, steep hill. This hill can only be mowed straight up and down. You can knock your sideways on it. It is way too steep. Um, so what we're going to do, I'm going to show you kind of the slope that we're at. And then I'm going to show you one of my employees mowing the hill and how we do this and stay safe while we're doing it because that safety is the most important thing. And um, it's one of those things that it's hard to learn, it's scary, but there's good money to be made. If you know how to mow these hills, then you can make some serious money. We mow this hill, it takes us about four to five minutes and we make $25 every time we mow it. So y'all stay tuned, let's figure out how to mow a hill. All right, so this is the hill that we're mowing. You can see the mower is straight up and down almost. Um, if you walk on this, it is extremely steep. This is like so steep. Let me get here where the mower's going it down a little bit but uh, it is a very very steep hill so when you walk up it I mean let me see I'll show you how far up we are maybe in relation to show you how steep this is so it's extremely steep this has to be mowed up and down like I said let's see how we do it See here we go straight up well we really can't go straight up it's too steep so we go at a vertical i mean at a, a uh, horizontal kind of it's not totally sideways side to side the mower would fall down the hill if you did that it would slide down so take an angle at it go up the angle go up and back down if you try to go down this thing straight your mower would just go flying you tear up the turf coming down it wouldn't be able to stop um, this is one of those things that is, you just trial and error to figure it out. But once you do, you can do it safely. We probably should have the roll bars up. If you're doing this, I would say put the roll bars up to be safe. That's what they're there for is if the mower did flip. But this is how we do it. Oh shit, don't come get me. So he's done. He's going to go mow property. We got just on the other side of those trees right there. Um, but this is it. Like I said, I'm going to try to show you here how steep this really is. I'm trying to give you the. It's hard to see on camera. It's hard to tell. But from the bottom side, you can see how steep the mower is. It is up there. What's up everybody so we are back i'm finally home now i had a long rest of the day took a shower feel much better it's like 60 degrees out there outside of my house right now it feels so good fall is finally here the weather's starting to break and it is an awesome feeling so real quick debrief on that video that we did earlier um of out mowing that yard so i want to take a quick clip while we were there just to show you 
the value of knowing how to mow a hill like that safely is really tremendous because if you can do that, and, and a lot of you guys don't have hills like that. If you're up north, you're kind of out in the Midwest, it's a lot of flat land, you don't really see that. But down here in the south, we have a lot of hills. A lot of hills that are even steeper than that, believe it or not. Um, by knowing how to mow that hill, then I can charge that customer a premium because she can't mow that herself. They have somebody else do their lawn, which is fine with me, but the person that does their lawn won't even mow their hill. So they have to get me to do it, another company. So I get to charge a premium for that, and it takes four to five minutes, and I charge them $25. I could charge more. A yard right down the street from them, because that whole row of houses is on the hill like that, I cut their hill as well. It takes me about two minutes, and I charge them $25. So I'm making the same amount of money in two minutes. And I, when I say two minutes, I seriously mean 120 seconds. I'm done. In and out. Um, so there is a value to that, but you have to be safe. You have to know how to do it the right way. I couldn't think of the word earlier, diagonal lines. Diagonal lines is what I was trying to pattern. It's the pattern I was trying to say earlier. Um, you can't go vertical. You cannot go up and down. Your mower will flip. You can't go horizontal side to side because your mower will just slide down. Um, so diagonal lines up the hill is what is best for that proper, that kind of property, that kind of hill. And uh, I would, like I said, I would say put your roll bar up, put your seatbelt on, be safe when you do it. Um, do everything right for us. We're just very comfortable with it, but you never want to get too comfortable. That's when injuries happen. That's how I cut my finger off with my hedge trimmers. We might do a video on that as well. I don't have it. I haven't done one yet. Um, but you get comfortable, you get lazy, action has happened. So anyway, I just want to do a deeper from that video. Thanks for tuning into it. I hope it was a value to you. Thanks for tuning into this video, period. If you like, if you did like the video and you want to see more content on YouTube, leave us a comment below, like the video, subscribe to the channel. We're going to try to get this thing fired back up heading into Equip Expo. We hope to see a lot of people there. And then heading into the winter, maybe put out a few videos a week. I don't know where YouTube goes. Our main uh, content right now that we put out is on the Growing Green podcast. So if you're watching this video and you don't know about the podcast, go check the podcast out on all major platforms. Uh, Growing Green Podcast, we talk all things business, entrepreneurship, um, things like that. On Mondays, we do a show on couples running a business together that are married, then how to stay married and be successful and have a healthy relationship. So that's hard to do while still running a business. So check out the podcast there, um, Instagram, at Growing Green Landscapes. But anyway, thanks for tuning into the video today, and we look forward to catching up with everybody here on the next video.